Hello there, Star Wars fans, and welcome back to another RebelScum.com figure review. Today, we are reviewing the Bo-Katan Kreese figure from the Wave 2 The Mandalorian Retro Collection. So now we're up to three different Mandos in that awesome vintage style. We've got The Mandalorian, we've got Boba Fett, now we've got Bo-Katan, and if you technically want to count him since he's a foundling, I guess we have four if you count Grogu. Almost forgot about little Grogu. And pretty soon, I think we'll have also five, because I believe they also did the armor in Wave 2 as well. So five if you count the figure we haven't reviewed yet, which is the armor. But stay tuned, because at some point we will be reviewing the retro, the armor figure. And here she is. She looks awesome in that vintage style. We got another awesome set of vintage-looking Mando. She's on that card back there. You got a really good shot of Bo-Katan, that... Really cool retro sticker right there. Words and things on the back. And that's pretty much it for the card back. She comes with two vintage style looking Mando blaster pistols. Which look really cool. Five POA as is tradition with that original Kenner style. Um, she does have holsters on her hips, but they're really tiny, and you definitely cannot <laughs> fit a blaster in that, or on it. This also marks our second 3 3 quarter scale Bo-Katan action figure. And I like how she's got her jetpack molded onto the back. She's got the armor plates. The helmet sculpt looks really cool. I love... Love the, the paint job they did on that. They did a very good job on that. And I love how they have the molded rangefinder, just like they did with the original Boba Fett toy when Kenner did the line. Got a cool little figure stand for her here. And for comparison, here she is next to the Vintage Collection Bo-Katan figure. So you can see how they stand side by side. So you have your original Kenner style next to that full detail vintage collection quality Bo-Katan. And they look really, really cool side by side. Of course, the Kenner style one doesn't have all of the paint details and all of the full articulation of the other. But for those of you who are just a little bit nostalgic and like to collect that retro line, this is a wonderful addition to any collection. What do you guys think of the retro collection so far? Do you really like that The Mandalorian got a wave two of retro? I am very excited for some of the other figures coming out. We've got a Death Trooper coming, we've got the Armorer coming, plus a few more other figures, including another Boba Fett in the vintage style. Very excited about that, so stay tuned for that review here on rebelscum.com. Make sure you go to the website daily, speaking of rebelscum.com, for all kinds of awesome news, articles and videos there's something posted every single day to the website and to stay updated with our videos make sure you're subscribed to the rebelscum.com youtube channel with notifications turned on that way you don't miss anything go to rebelscumshop.com for all kinds of exclusive and awesome merch we'll see you guys later we'll see you another time may the force be with all of you you rebel scum